Our governor, I can tell you, has only been a phone call away when it's come to matters concerning the city of Camden. He has been the governor that has made Camden his focus to transform this urban center into an anchor that can be proud, that we can all be proud of throughout the state of New Jersey. We know that his leadership in working with our Senate and our Assembly has been spoken loudly in not only the Higher Education Restructuring Act, but also the Economic Opportunity Act of 2013 that promises to leverage jobs for the city of Camden. And we look forward to making great announcements with him on the job creation and those developments and businesses that are coming to the city of Camden, again, because of his foresight, because of his leadership, and because I know that he has Camden in his heart. All these reforms and changes are important, but the credit really goes wholly to the men and women in uniform and the leadership of this force who are turning opportunity for progress into actual progress. All the time, what we try to do is present people with opportunities, opportunities to grow and get better. And as the mayor said, here in Camden, it's not just limited to what we're doing in terms of fighting crime in this city. It's also having a, a new, active, engaged superintendent of schools who is really making difference here in the city of Camden for families and their students and making sure that economic growth comes back to Camden and the Economic Opportunity Act of 2013 that I was proud to sign last year is already showing results here in Camden and I suspect that I'll be back here a number of times more over the course of the next six months with more important announcements about Camden's economic future and that's really important as well. So I, I want to thank the mayor once again. This does not happen, I will guarantee you. Um, and she is too humble to say it, but it does not happen without her leadership and her commitment. Um, easy enough to talk about these things, much more difficult to do them and to put up with, at times, the criticism that will come from bringing real significant change. But there can be no question that this city needed really significant change and that this mayor has been the person who has brought that change to the forefront for the citizens of the city that I know she loves with all her heart. So, Mayor, thanks for having me and congratulations.